readings effective time and task management skills are essential for professionals in today's fast paced and changing world from managing workloads and meeting deadlines to balancing personal and professional responsibilities the ability to effectively manage time and task is critical for success they help us increase productivity reduce stress and burnout helps improve decision making and also enhances professional reputation let us look at the story a motivational and inspirational journey time and task management skills for professionals there was a professional called sam he was working he was working as a project manager in a fast paced company and there were a lot of deadlines he was constantly battling deadlines and struggling to keep up with them and there were a lot of tasks and uh, he had to attend to them end of the day it left him drained and demoralized his performance also suffered and it was also noticed by others in the company sam knew he needed to take attention action he embarked on a mission to master time and task management skills so he started looking into various books articles written on time and task management he also started uh, looking out for online courses and he also sought guidance from others and this phase was quite a turning point and he discovered several techniques tips strategies to face the obstacles which he encountered daily now he was full of optimism sam began testing the tips and the strategies and to his amazement and delight he observed a remarkable shift in his productivity organizational goals achievement and overall job satisfaction so bit by bit he refined his approach and he came up with some interesting amazing 20 tips strategies for effective time and task management which i am going to share with you so let us look at some of the goals some of the tips and strategies the first one is we should have smart goals goals can be short term medium term long term based on time factor and also based on objectives or goals it can be financial educational professional health wise there are so many other objectives or goals as they say what are the things you want to achieve but goals have to be smart or is smart specific goals should be specific measurable it should not be abstract it should be measurable achievable you cannot have unrealistic goals they have to be achievable relevant realistic and also time bound and uh, the time bound is very important as time is a limited factor it is not unlimited resource so there is a time frame and the goals have to be achieved so start setting smart goals what you want to achieve so short term goals you can list out what are the things you want to done to be done second is medium term and long term so set yourself smart goals prioritize tasks what happens is some of the tasks are urgent and important some tasks will be urgent some will be important some of them will neither be 
urgent, not important. So we have to prioritize which are the tasks to be taken first. Prioritize them. If you spend your time on those tasks which are neither urgent nor important, probably it will lead to a imbalance. You will have problems with time and task management. So you are working on a project. So break down the projects into smaller manageable tasks. So you may not look at the so there's a big project which has come up and you want to be sort of finishing it on time. So rather than tar targeting it as it is, I break it up into smaller projects or smaller bits so that each bit can be achieved in a faster way. Use time blocks. So should you dedicate time for each task? So you put up, you know, for some activities, you have certain blocks of time. So utilize them. And it will help to greater focus and productivity. Delegate wisely. See, all the work need not be done by you. Some of the work which can be done by others can be allocated. But the thing is, you have to also monitor them. So ensure the work is delegated also to the right person. The right job for the right person. So delegation is a very important skill for people who want to manage time and task. Avoid multitasking. Here we are not telling you that multitasking is bad. You should be skilled in multitasking. So you should know to do various tasks, but focus on one task at a time so that there's better efficiency and concentration. Set deadlines. So Create your own deadlines and uh, this will ensure timely completion and avoid procrastination. What is procrastination? It is delaying things. So we keep on postponing things. It can be due to different factors like lack of interest, lack of knowledge about the thing which we are going to do or feeling afraid, fear of what other person might think if the work is not done properly. So you have to overcome that. Stop procrastinating. Start the task, however unpleasant it is. So by focusing on that and avoiding procrastination, you will be able to finish your task within the deadlines. Track time. Yes, there will be a lot of time wasters. Some people dropping in for gossip or chatting or doing so many other things, irrelevant things. So ensure you avoid the time wasters and also improve efficiency. Declutter. So ensure that your workplace is decluttered. No unnecessary things are lying around. Whatever is to be done are arranged and organized. Break the procrastination cycle. So that's what I said, you should avoid procrastination, that is delaying things. So always have many short-term objectives so that, and also avoid distractions. However, interesting or motivating it might be. Establish routines. So what we are telling you here is create a structure for your day-to-day. -day. So what are the things you are going to do in the first half of the day? On the second half, which things can be, should be taken on a priority basis, which can be postponed or taken up later. So have a structure. Manage email. Yes, today it is a digital world and there is a lot of pressure on handling emails. Some of them will be urgent and important. Some will be important. Some will be urgent. Certain mails will be neither urgent, neither important. So also you can schedule specific times for checking emails and processing the messages. So today it is a very big activity which takes most of our time at the workplace or at the personal home front also. So managing email is a very important task. Be assertive, that is say no when necessary. Learn to refuse unimportant time-consuming endeavors. 
sometimes what we do is because of not being assertive we tend to commit and then we regret so it's better to say no when you want to say no say yes when to want to say yes but in a polite and diplomatic manner so don't get involved in unimportant unnecessary tasks efficient communication in fact this is one of the thing which is very important and has a lot of impact on time and task management if the communication is not effective the same thing has to be done again and again and again isn't it so have good communication skills effective communication skills and also encourage people to be concise clear and uh, have proper communication strategies in place so keep the communication simple clear effective concise and also keep a to do list sometimes you know we just spend time without knowing what to do having a to do list will be useful so you can keep it in physical format or digital format but also organize your tasks and responsibilities what are the things to be done it should be prioritized reflect on progress yes also monitor them regularly review your goals and what are the lessons to be learned and learned stay prepared so there will be sudden urgencies anticipate potential challenges and also have contingency plans so you have a plan a which is not working out then you should have a plan b which will help you stay prepared take care of yourself yes you are also important so if you are not mental mentally and physically fit that can also lead to time and task mismanagement or delay so prioritize your health so that when you are healthy you tend to produce more new tools yes have a positive approach start accepting changes so embrace new tools and uh, new tools are coming up apps are there software are there so they will help you to stay organized and finally keep learning so you have to stay open to refining and updating your time and task management strategies continuous learning it's very important so sam perfected his approach he learned from this started utilizing all these steps and strategies and he climbed up the career ladder with unwavering resilience his story became a sort of you know beacon of motivation for others it inspired others to also tackle their time and task management challenges so what is the moral of this story the moral of this story is perseverance determination to learn and adaptability can indeed transform your professional life so start employing the tips and strategies provided by sam take control of your time and task management it will also lead you to success thank you